Oh, well, how did it go? How does it go? Chicken wing, chicken wing, hot dog. You'll never have more fun in any other costume. Whether you want to chase people down, give hugs with 250 fingers, body slam, or mosh pit, this is it. It's a super easy and cheap costume to make. 10 to 20 bucks without lights, or 40 to 50 dollars with lights. Talk a friend into dressing up the same with you and have 10 times the fun. Or a group of friends, 100 times the fun. <laughs> First, just get any shirt or top that you want to use. I like using a long sleeve white t-shirt. And then get a hold of some latex gloves. Uh, they have to be latex for you to be able to blow them up. And if you're going to blow them up with your mouth, you definitely want them to be powder free. Uh, in the description section of my YouTube video, I'll link where you can get these and more information about exactly what you want to get. And then get some red balloons. I uh, used 10 of them. I didn't use the purple ones in the end. And then you blow them up and tie them. I blew up the gloves to about five and a half inches in diameter, not including the fingers, and the red balloons to about five inches. And I didn't use the purple ones in the end. And you can blow them up by mouth or using this $10 inflator. And if you don't mess around, it'll take you less time. And then get yourself some assorted safety pins from the dollar store. And then you just start pinning them on the shirt. Uh, in the end, it's easiest to do it if you hang the shirt from a hanger from the ceiling, and then you can work around it easiest. And before you know it, you've created it. With 50 gloves, 10 red balloons, and 250 menacing fingers. And then if you want to make it epic, add this 33 foot LED rope, battery powered, remote control, and one of the brightest and coolest ones I've found. The LED rope is just really flexible and you just run it underneath and between the gloves and the balloons and they'll hold it in place. You don't need to pin it or anything. And it comes with a 7 foot battery cable to reach any pocket you might have. Light it up! When you choose your lights, uh, make sure they're battery powered because most of them out there aren't. And don't get the ones that are like tape on a roll because they only have LED lights on one side and they'll get flipped over so you won't be able to see most of them. These are the best lights I've found. And again, in the description section below my video, I have Amazon links to these lights and to the latex gloves and to anything else you might need. Ah!